It's time for Ryan's Roses. Here we go. If it's a public service, if there's an issue in your world, you can't sort it out, come to us and we'll try our best. Dear Ryan and Sissini, on Halloween, my husband dressed up as Mario. But we didn't do a family costume. Later that night, I found out that a woman we know is dressed as Princess Peach. And her baby was dressed as Toad. Anybody want to fill me in on that? Well, so Mario and Princess Peach and Toad are like kind of a family matching costume. Where? Uh, from what universe? Marvel? From Nintendo. The Mario Brothers. Oh, Nintendo universe. Mario? I had Nintendo Mario. Mm-hmm. Are Princess Peach and Baby Toad new? No. No. I had not Mario since, like, the 80s. Nintendo. That's it. Yeah. That's that I, universe. Oh, that was the princess's name? Yes. Yeah, Princess, princess Peach. Peach. Oh, okay. A little pink dress. Right. I, it only takes me one time. I got it. <laughs> Holly, good morning. Thank you for coming on. So, I'm trying to. So, you found out the woman you know is dressed as Princess Peach and her baby is Toad. So, you think that he did a family costume with another family? Yeah. Like, I don't know. I know this kind of sounds crazy, but like on Halloween, my husband dressed up, you know, as Mario for our Halloween party, which is fine. But I had asked him if he wanted to do like a theme costume, like him and I. And he was like, oh, I don't want to. It's too complicated. Like, fine, no big deal. But then later, I see on Instagram that this woman that we know, but we don't really hang out with a lot, um, at least not anymore, is dressed as Princess Peach. And her baby, um, who's only like a few months old, was dressed as Toad. But- uh, okay, I know it's a little weird, but like a little backstory. Like, I always felt like there was some mutual flirting between the two of them and like to be honest that's kind of why i didn't want to hang out with her anymore and i had no idea that she had a kid like okay i, I don't even see a husband or a partner on her profile were you at and the same thought, event or school function or the same street how'd you see everybody in the same place no see her party her party or whatever party she was at um was on friday when i thought my husband was working late and our party was on saturday all right. Now, why would your husband, if he's trying to hide something, dress up as Mario? Right. That's where my like, head to is me. At. It's, it's it's as if he's wanting to tell you that his princess is named Peach. I know. I know it sounds crazy, you know and I mean? like, I I don't know. I feel like there's a possibility that they've been seeing each other, and I don't know. Maybe that I don't know. So crazy, but I'm wondering if the baby is his, and I haven't asked him because like. I don't know. I'm obviously too nervous. But again, I think then... Tanya and I are struggling with... Wait, this, no, no, if... Ryan. What? And now I think I see. Maybe he told this woman he was going to be Mario, and they didn't plan on doing this costume together, but she, when she found out he was Mario, she's like, I want to out him in our affair, and I'm going to dress as Princess Peach and dress my baby as Toad. Hmm. That makes more sense. It's possible. Yeah, it's it's plausible. All right, look, Holly, hold on one second. Oh, I don't know. I'm, I'm uh, I don't know. We'll come back and see if we can find out more. Make the call. So we're about to make the call with Holly here. She and her family, Holly's family, they do Halloween, and her husband dresses up as Mario. Then this other woman that she questions anyway, she sees on social at another party. That that woman, the other woman dressed up as the family to Mario. You see? Right. Family yeah. costumes, two different families. And she sees it and she's like, I always suspected something from this woman. Now she's Princess Peach and her kid was dressed up as Baby Toad. And then she says, my husband's dressed up as Mario with us. They're like Mario's family over there at that place. Is that really my husband's baby in real life? I mean, it's almost too confusing to understand when I try and tell you. So let's get to the call. Okay. Holly is on with us now. Holly, let's see if we can find out. Um, I need you to say, Ryan, you have my permission to call and then your husband's name on Kiss FM. Go ahead. Ryan, you have my permission to call my husband on Kiss FM. Okay, we're going to do that now. Be very quiet until we tell him he's on the air. Let's see what we can find out, okay? Okay. Here we go. Good luck. Hello. Hi, is this Martin? Yes. Hi, Martin. Good morning. My name is Sarah. I'm from Silky Flowers. For you, we're a new flower shop 
in town and I was just calling because we just got this beautiful shipment of red roses this morning and we want to get our name out there in the area. So I want to offer them to you free of charge. I don't need any credit card information, just the name of who you want to send them to and a note. Um, wow, that's, that's cool. Um, how'd you get my number? We are partners with a couple people on Instagram and Facebook, and we get different phone numbers because of the algorithm, maybe things that you've liked. Uh Uh-huh. Okay. And so this isn't like some kind of club or something. I don't have to join anything and monthly or anything like that. Nope. I'm not going to take any of your personal information. I just need a name if you want to send the flowers to a note, and I'll get them out by 1 o'clock today. Huh. Uh... Can can you hold on a second? Yeah, of course. I can hang on for as long as you need. Yeah, you know what? Um, Hey, I am. I'm really not interested, and I need to go. So um, I'm really not sure what's going on here. But I I'm not interested in sending any flowers to anybody. Definitely not. Thank you. Oh, Martin, are you Uh, Martin? Martin, your voice Uh, to be broadcast on the radio. Martin, can you hear me? Can you hang on one second? Martin, are you there? Yeah, I. Yeah, who's this? Martin, my name is Ryan Seacrest. We have your wife, Holly, on the line. And I what? I just want to jump in before you jump off. We're calling because she is concerned about something that happened on Halloween. Did you dress up as Mario? Just stay with me on this. Did you dress up as Mario for Halloween? Yeah. Okay, and then there's a woman that you both know that was dressed up as Mario's Princess Peach. And the her child was Baby Toad. And your wife, Holly, is concerned. Did you plan to be Mario and then plan to be Princess Peach? And are you cheating on your wife? What? No. Look, I don't even like Halloween, okay? Holly, right. I just don't to make you happy. What? I don't, hey, I don't well, know. Martin, Princess dude, Peach, I don't even know what Martin, you're Martin, about. Martin, we're just asking questions. No need to yell. Holly, who is this other woman? You want to tell Martin about the other woman? It's Brittany. Brittany? Don't I just... I just... I, I don't... I can't explain it, but I felt something in, like, the pit of my stomach when I saw her photo with that baby on Instagram. And don't you think it's a little weird? It, that she Maybe it's a coincidence. I, look, I dressed up to make you happy. And now... No, 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 no. But Martin, be- Martin, 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 did you know that Brittany was going to be Princess Peach? No way. No, okay. I... All right. No. All right. Can I also go a little further, Martin and Holly, with your permission? But I think I have it from what you told me. She's always felt a little weird about Brittany. So, Martin, what have you done to make your wife wonder about what's going on with you and Brittany? Nothing. I haven't done anything. I haven't seen Brittany in... I don't remember the last time. Holly, when, when did we see Brittany? I, I don't remember. This is crazy. This is crazy. So right. you really were She's working crazy. late on Friday night? Yeah, I was Where working were you on Friday, Friday night. night. Uh, um, I was working. This is, look, I was just trying to make you happy, okay? I'm trying to make Martin. everyone happy here. What's going on? Martin, is Brittany's mm. baby your baby? Oh, my God. No way. What? No way. That's crazy. That's Holly, Holly, please tell Martin where your head went on this. I just... I know that you guys have always had, like, this little thing. Like, every time I see you guys interacting together, it's like I can see that you guys are flirting. I know that you guys have some sort of a connection. I don't know how often you guys hang out or communicate in some form, either on social media or real life. I'm just like, I don't know. I just, I just want to hear you tell me that you are not the father of that child. Holly, honey. I, I'm not hanging out with Brittany. I am not the father of that child. Crazy. Martin, I, I, what did you mean when you say or keep saying or try to make everyone happy? What does that mean? Who's everyone? Everyone. Holly, the kids, people putting me on the radio. I'm just, I'm just that's what I but do. But it sounds to me, happy. Uh, again, it sounds to me like you're saying, hey, I got to make... Holly happy and Brittany happy. No, I, look, I hadn't thought about Brittany in forever. I, I don't know where you where you got this uh, from. What uh, your wife told me you had 
Well, yeah. Well, I don't know where she got the idea. This look. This I gotta go. This is just a waste. Waste of time. I gotta go. All right. I'm just gonna tell you, Martin. I don't believe you. And go ahead. Bye, bye, Martin. You can hang up. Holly, I do not believe him at all. I think the only way I'm going to get my answer is probably I'm going to have to confront her. Look, if you're prepared to, could... if you're prepared to do that, I mean, who are we to tell you not to? But I just want to give you a, a quick reaction to your husband's reaction. I mean, his reaction was not a reaction of, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry you even thought that or my or whatever it just wasn't the right reaction to me i don't know like i i don't even know if i can describe it but it was not to me the right reaction of someone that was completely innocent and maybe i'm cynical because i've heard too many of these but i didn't it sounded to me there was something going on there i know i'm, I'm shaking right now like i i i don't know no, i don't know i, I don't i want to believe him and i and i can't i don't we're going to let you go uh, with that information and just do the best you can to find peace. And thank you, Holly. Thank you, Ryan. Okay, bye bye. What would you think, Tanya? Definitely sketchy, but I, I don't, I, I don't know. I don't think he's necessarily cheating. Holly and Martin. Holly and Martin were just on, and Martin. It's too complicated to even explain that Martin dressed up as Mario and then this other woman that Holly suspected he had a thing with dressed up as Princess Peach and her child was Toad. So they're in two different places for Halloween, but they're in the same family character costume. So she already had weird feelings about the woman that was playing Princess Peach for Halloween. Then he dresses up as Mario and then he keeps saying, trying to make everybody happy. And I'm thinking, oh, he's trying to make both families happy. And then she wonders, is the other woman's baby... Her husband's baby. You almost have that to write to it me, down. Yeah, and that to me was a bit of a stretch. Hey, she told us all this stuff. Mm-hmm. Well, yeah, but she said she had a feeling. Like, to say that she so thinks he, somebody's baby fine. had somebody's baby feels... But yeah, that's a big... Well, I, I, she told us that. She thought oh, that. I know. All right. So anyway, he denied, 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 but he got so amped about it. That it just, it's not how it would happen if there was something, if there was no truth to any of it, that's not how somebody reacts. I don't think. Totally my view. I don't think he's cheating. Or I don't think he's the father of that baby. I actually think that maybe the other woman is the one after going after him. Right. So, so that would work that she knew he was going to be Mario, and then she dresses up as Princess Peach and Baby Toad with her kid to try and throw feelers to Holly's husband. <laughs> like, I'm trying to figure. I mean, it I, would, out, I wouldn't say it. it's, not, it's not that s- simple. Well, I, you know, I, I'm sitting here. I'm trying to s- simplify it. But I think that you know what? Maybe they didn't cheat. Maybe they had some, you know, DMing each other on Instagram, and they oh. decided. You know, she found out he was going to be Mario, and she's like, you know what? Just to tease him a little, I'm going to be the princess. All right, well, look, we don't know. I didn't like him. (laughs) Let's get to Jordan. Jordan, good morning. How are you? I'm good. How are you, Ray? Good. So tell me, he got it. You you heard that. What was your observation? Oh, that guy is definitely guilty. Yeah, right? Of of, of guilt, but of what? Like, of what? Well, I mean, who, who gets that defensive right away? He didn't even seem shocked that he was being accused of something. Right, right. And, and also, it seemed a little weird when he paused and said, hold on, before ex- deciding to accept the flowers or not. Like, I feel like maybe that other woman, Brittany, was, like, listening or something. Like, maybe she texted him and said, do not accept these so flowers. So, meaning, meaning you think he does have something going on with Brittany? Yeah. Okay. Definitely. He seems very guilty. And he seems... The way he kept saying, like, I'm trying to make everyone happy. Like, who is everyone? That was so weird. (laughs) Yeah, that was so weird. weird. I'm trying to make everyone happy, meaning Brittany and Holly. Yeah, that that was definitely shady when he said everyone. That's a weird statement. All right, we'll leave it at that, Jordan. Thank you very much for calling. You take care. Have a good day. Thanks, you too. Bye.